What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Will Motivation, back again with another video. And today, we are talking to the kids in a special program, like a summer program, here in Columbus, Ohio. And we're headed to the Parker Roses. We're taking out the BMW M4 for a little extracurricular activity. We got Kenny over there. He did a BMW M8 with, with the Beamer Boys today. And unfortunately, we don't have the rest of the crew with us, but there's, there may be some other people there that have some cool cars. Basically, we're going to talk to the kids about career pathways. Man, I barely got any sleep last night, but we're dedicated to giving back in this video. Discipline, no success. 
tell you guys my favorite saying that motivated me, and that is figure out what you want and act accordingly. So everybody says like they want to be rich and stuff like that, right? I want to be rich or I want to be famous, only this and that. You don't really want that unless you're willing to do what it takes to get it. So figure out what you want and act accordingly. Let's say you, you want to be whatever in the future. You want to be famous, successful, you want to run your own business, you want to be a doctor, whatever. Figure out what other people have done to get there. Because there's always a story. If you look at your situation, you might not think it's possible for you to get there. There's always a story of somebody that was just like you that got to where you want to be. So figure out what you want and act accordingly. Act like you really want. Choosing who you associate with. When I went to college, when I was in high school, I was smart, so I didn't really study and stuff. So I ended up with like a 2.9 GPA, went to college and stuff like that. But when I went to college, I knew I had to pay for it, and I knew I was going so that I could make money when I graduated. That was my whole mission. I didn't care anything about the games, the plan, all that stuff. I wanted to make money. So when I went to school, I chose my roommate who by coincidence was going to my same college, was in my high school. And he was the valedictorian, he was the number one student in my high school. And I was like, maybe if I, if he's my roommate, then I can see how he studies and how he does what he does to be the number one student. He ended up being the, the number one or number two student in the whole entire university. And but, but when I was chose him as my, as my um, roommate, I saw how he studied. Every time he came home to the room, he was in the books. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna just copy what he does. Figure out what you want and act accordingly. I want to make money. I want to be the number one. I don't want to be the number one student in the whole college. <laughs> I want to be like the number one in my department. And I, and I ended up being the number one in my department because I chose to be around people to the fresh point that could bring me up and, and do things in a way that I could learn from them and end up being where I want to be. Growing up, I didn't have any examples of my parents didn't make money, really. So I didn't have any examples, but I had to figure it out as well. But it went back to my saying, which is figure out what you want and act accordingly. So I wanted to be rich. I wanted to be wealthy. I wanted to have crazy stuff, you know, like whatever. So figured out what I want and act accordingly. So I started looking at people that had money and what they did. And what I noticed is people that had a lot of money had real estate. So I started buying real estate. I bought houses, a lot of houses, and land and stuff like that. I just, because I saw that's what people were doing when they had money. Then I started learning about it. Like I taught, I bought books and stuff and started reading how to invest in real estate. Uh, I've invested in the stock market, but I figured out what people were doing that had money and I started copying what they did. one and only Floyd Money Mayweather. I'm here to tell you guys to go to Wheel Motivation. The exotic cars is crazy. I've been watching this show for a little while now and it's growing. But we need everybody else to subscribe to Wheel Motivation and support Wheel. I'm supporting them. You do the same.